Oh wait, I think that is Jake. That might be. Cause I mean I get the joke, but <laughs> nonetheless though, uh Jake pretty much told me what his tack was. So if it was wrong, I'd feel terrible about this. Oh. But no, I'm I'm pretty sure it's Jake. Alright. Because his name is Jake, and there's only one reason he would be calling himself Jake from Snake Farm. And without a yes. doubt... Obviously, the epic meme. It's such a time for Jake to be in such dominance with Steve to see him go Mario is kind of offsetting here. But nonetheless, I, I, I kind of want to say it might be a matchup thing or something he's doing for the stream. And I applaud Jake, no matter what, to the commitment here. So, of course, he is rocking the Mario against 9 Super Pi. Definitely one of the strongest... Wi-Fi Wii trainers I've seen in a hot minute. Uh, there's quite a few of them. Floppe, definitely from SoCal, is also one of them. But Nine Super Pie definitely stands out amongst many others. And so far, Jake has done a pretty good job of just trying to keep the pressure here on a Wii Fi trainer. You kind of know that if you keep your distance around Wii Fi trainer and you don't fall for those dual-sided hitboxes, you will be more in the green than in the red percent. I guess a white percent is the word, proper terminology here. And so far, with grab here, and of course. On the cross of nine super pie, not able to hit it. All right, looks like nine super pie is gonna have to come back here uh, if he wants to take the uh, if he wants to close out. Uh, I mean, my bad. Jake has to come back here if he wants to close out super pie stock. But nice uh, uh, grab ledge to make super pie go off in back air, coming out. Yeah, when you nice think double down air. Yeah, it's a good juggle tool. Honestly, it's got quite a few lasting hitboxes. So if nine super pie tries to return towards center stage like that. Uh, you will face definitely many hitboxes. And that's why I try to tell people, you know, when you're trying to land and avoid getting juggle hit towards the ledge. And so far, though, Jake has enough time after the recovery to kind of avoid 9 Super Pie. And it's kind of the battle for center stage as Jake slips through 9 Super Pie on the forward throw. All the setup here at the ledge, but he narrowly misses the mark. And that's so big because now Jake gets to juggle him on the platforms. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. That, oh, that almost killed. But the good thing, oh, nice. Okay, good thing he had the deep breathing. I don't think that would have killed if he didn't have it. Uh, getting back to stage, nice, uh, nice using the side B to get back. Oh, but uh, Jake read his uh, jump get up. He's trying to get back to stage, but he's also using his projectiles to keep Jake away from the stage, so he uh, the ledge, so he can't get close. He, uh, Jake, is doing. I'm, uh, pretty well, uh, here. Nice side smash to finish it off. And, uh, 9 Super Pie has to try to close out this, uh, next stock soon, or else, uh, it's going to get pretty difficult here. Yeah, when you think about, like, fighting Mario, he's one of the characters that could definitely snowball you in terms of combos. So if you're not able to effectively get out, oh my god, watch oh. yourself on the recovery! I hate fighting Mario because Mario will just forget every logic and will go for forward air just because of how well it lasts off the stage. Look at that situation. What logic would forward air work there? But I think it's just understanding that that situation, nine super pie might actually panic and try to go for that situation where like directional air dodge towards the stage like that. Good call out attempt there. They're off the backboard, but no hit here. Jake gets the opportunity to come back on the stage. 137. Nine super pie is not having a good time. I mean, hasn't taken care of the stock quite yet. Yeah, uh, Night Super Pie's got a. I mean, he's in ra uh, slight rage right now, but that's not going to do much. Uh, uh, he's got his deep breathing, but the up smash is going to close out Night Super Pie's last stock. Good stuff on Jake, trying to just understand. I think there was quite a few times where Nine Super Pie just tried a little bit too hard to land towards center stage, and unfortunately, Jake was definitely the one out there to catch him for it. And I think that's really good as Mario. That's kind of like one of the things Mario has is that up smash is not only an anti-air, but it's good on mix-ups on your opponent, right? If you fake out a jump or if you read your opponent's landing options, it's really good. I think out of all the characters, that surprises me in terms of landing options is probably Wii Fit just because Wii Fit has a plethora of tools to get around you in terms of projectiles. But when it comes to landing, she kind of has to commit a little bit because she doesn't have anything that lasts long on the stage but uh as i say that nine super fight switching not to wario a character that i feel like so much has so many have ridden off with the recent nurse but i think the character still got some sauce man it's kind of you can't sleep on the character who has got a st pretty strong comeback mechanic and especially one that's just been slightly so changed but it's a big deal all the way through yeah i mean wario is uh <clears throat> is a pretty good character uh, but i mean Jake can easily uh, come, uh, can easily get, uh, 
get a dub here if he just uses his combos uh if he just uses his combos as well as he can yeah honestly it's it's all on jake to use a lot of wario's lasting hitbox solid area movement to get around mario I'm a Wario. Mario at that point, uh, fortunately that up, you know, so costly because you only end up in front of Mario and that forward smash will take care of a lot of things there. This is going to be a great back air to up throw and the combos continue, man. If I were Jake, look, you got to watch the DI, but the spot dodge will start things off here. Double up tilt, reads the lining yet again. That's what 9 Super Pi needs to keep going here is reading out the lining options against Jake. Yeah, 9 Super Pi is uh, racking up the percent on Jake right now, but he is, you, you can tell that he's struggling uh, to try to keep uh, Jake away. You can tell that he's trying to uh, space using the back airs as well. Mm -hmm. um, and also, oh, nice side smash coming out. Uh, he's using the down B. He's keeping him in the air, though, very well. And it's kind of what you want to do. Like, Wario's, Wario has a down air to land, but the problem is that a down air is kind of committal. So Wario is forced to go off the stage or try to hit an air or bait you in a situation like that. Back air is really good just because it lasts a little bit while. It's got a... I would say it's a little bit bigger than you would expect. Mario's back air. Man, oh, man. It's got 9 Super Pie still in a tough situation, but a 9 Super Pie on the cross up gets the stage control. That's an excellent downer to stop the recovery, but unfortunately, you're out of a bike, and when you're out of a bike, you're somewhat out of a recovery because you know 9 Super Pie wanted to stall there. Yeah. Because since the bike gives him an extra jump, he would have been able to make it back, but since he didn't have it, sadly, he wasn't able to. But uh, he can still come back here if uh, he doesn't get juggled continuously by Jake and also tries to keep Jake off stage. Yeah, and that's that's kind of like nine super prize objective right there. Keep Jake off the stage, right? Oh no, that was rough for Jake. Uh, but for nine super prize, that's gonna be a pretty big W there. Uh, each stock a piece, you know, Wario Wax is activated at this point because you see that yellow glow. Like we talked about earlier here, Mighty Man, those confirms they were nerfed. They're a little different now, and I think you should never sleep on Wario nonetheless. Yeah, I mean. Nerfing doesn't mean that the character is just bad. It's just it's a little bit different. So you just got to get used to it if you're going to main the character. But then also you have to be aware of these uh, updates that have happened to this character. Oh, crucial up be there. And it would have been rough too if 9 Super Pi... I'm sorry. If 9 Super Pi definitely was a little bit closer to Jake, that would have been rough for Jake because you could just get the loft there and steal everything. Yeah, loft is a little, it's a little something else if you can tell, but... Jake is try is being a little uh, uh as I can see he did the double uh side smash he's tr he can he's literally trying to get rid of this stock and he closes it out with another up smash like from last game. Oh, and that's rough too because that was a good call nonetheless against Nine Super Pie. Nine Super Pie had a couple opportunities. I think that's like the one thing Jake looked to call it against Nine Super Pie was the common option, which is something you might see from Wario. Wario might be trying to poke through, cross you up trying to go for bike from the ledge just to get back towards center stage the problem there is you're still going for a jump and at the end of the day if you're mario or we for trainer that hurt box will stand out there for a cool second and you can actually punish that with wario up smash